Islands of Adventure. I might pop over to Universal Studios for a bit, we'll see. I might try and take it a bit easier today, my feet are still really hurting. And I've got four full days planned in to do Islands of Adventure and Universal, so I've got plenty of time. So I might come home early, maybe have a swim, take it a little easier today, even though that was the plan for yesterday. But I'm almost ready to head out, so let's go. So I've just arrived at Universal City Walk. Soon to be heading into Islands of Adventure. My camera's a little bit foggy because of how humid it is today. But at least this is the weather I expected when I came to Florida. Not the rain we've had the last couple of days. And so it begins. Marvel Land first. Overhead you can hear people screaming on the Hulk. I think I'm going to do that later, but not right now. I have to work up the courage for that one. First stop, Spider-Man.
Expecting the movement of the vehicle, you, you felt like you were almost upside down at points. So it was great. Unfortunately, Hagrid's roller coaster is closed at the minute and they don't know whether they're going to open today again. So I'll have to check back later or maybe another day. So I've just found a quiet spot to relax for a few minutes. I'm going to try and go on Hulk, but if you have to use your Universal Pass to swipe in and out of the locker, then I'm gonna have to wait for another day because I forgot to bring my lanyard so that it would stay with me. But I have a beautiful view right now. So if I can't get on Hulk, then I might head out to City Walk to get something to eat and then head back to the resort. Well, it's much later now. I tried to go ride the Hulk, but unfortunately, the locker system, you have to have your park ticket to lock and unlock the lockers. So, I didn't have my lanyard with me, so I didn't want to risk taking my ticket loose on the ride. So I decided to just get an Uber back, got back to the hotel, relaxed for a little bit, went for a swim in the pool, got some food at the intermission food court, and now I'm going to head off for an early night. So hopefully I'll be well rested for tomorrow, where hopefully I'm going to head to the outlets. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. So... I had a great time at Islands of Adventure yesterday. I just wanted to say that I didn't say yesterday. Single rider, I used a lot. And it shaved a lot of time off my weight. You do miss out on a lot of the theming of the queues and any pre-ride shows. But for me, particularly yesterday, I just wanted to be in and out of a ride as fast as possible. Maybe when I go back, I'll maybe go and do sort of the Harry Potter Hogwarts queue properly because I've heard that's amazing and I missed out on again on the pre-show ride pre-ride show it's morning I'm very tired <laughs> but yeah single rider probably saves you about 45 minutes depending on how long the queue is so today I'm heading out shopping to the outlets and then I'm hoping to go over to Mol uh, Millennia this evening so I don't know how much I'll be actually filming of me shopping but hopefully you'll at least see a little bit so I'll see you later bye 
good morning so yesterday i went shopping i went to the orlando premium outlets and then i went to mullet millennia to meet with a friend and we had a meal at the cheesecake factory which was amazing best cheesecake i've ever had i had the white chocolate raspberry truffle so good but while i was at the outlets i visited various shops i went to the character warehouse but there wasn't really anything that I wanted so I managed to refrain from actually spending any money in there but I did go to Bath and Body Works and pick up some of the amazing smelling antibacterial hand gels so I'll show you those here so to start with I got a little pouch for the antibacterial hand gels that will clip onto my bag and remind me to actually put some on while I'm in the parks so the one that's currently in there is A Thousand Wishes and then I got the five for six dollars deal I got the Stress Relief Eucalyptus and Spearmint Beautiful Day Hey Thanks Champagne Toast and Sunshine and Lemons and they all smell amazing and then I also discovered Old Navy and bought this really pretty dress I think that was about $18 So all in all, I had a wonderful day shopping. I just put the camera down and had a fantastic day, especially when I met up with my friend Jordan. So there wasn't any footage to show you from yesterday, but today I'm off to Universal. So hopefully a lot more things to see today.